no idea. Yeah, something I figured people enjoy, you know. Oh, I don't really care, mate, if they do or not, to be honest. It's like, Leo does what Leo wants, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> anyway, get a goosey ganders at this. What do you think? Yeah. I'll call it Moose School. It is a study of like what if cares had arms instead of legs or like at least two arms instead of four legs. They'd have two legs, two arms, like us. You know. Behold the man, all that shit. Anyway, I just thought it'd be a bit of fun. You know, moose school, it's a bit funny. I thought the Medici's might quite like it because they got that sort of, you know, that wicked sense of humour in it, those. You know, those banking families, they aren't nearly as bad as everyone always says. Like, to be honest with you, their patronage it's what keeps me afloat, you know. That's how I can afford this lovely, lovely new workshop. All mod cons got underfloor eating, you know, the lot. Proper, proper Roman in here, mate. Proper Renaissance, which is the time where we are now. Oi, oi. Mona Lisa having a nap next door. Yeah, well, she's my mate. I got her over last night and I was like, do you want me to take your picture? And she's like, oh yeah, go on in Leo, let's have a look. So I get her set down, like, I take a picture. And she's not fucking smiling. So I say, Lisa, Mona Lisa. Can we try it again, but this time can you try and like, you know, give me a grin or something? Anyway, he does it again, I take the picture. What's happened again? She ain't fucking smiling. So I say, Lisa, we'll give it one more go. Yeah, so look, sit down, give us a smile, I'll take a nice pic. We'll share it around, people might like it, you never know. We do it again. She ain't smiling. I say, you're tearing me apart, Lisa. I just want to take a nice picture, you know, for your profile or whatever. Get you in at the, the uh, court, stuff like that. Anyway, so I tell her about my new idea, moose school, the care with muscles. Well, then she bloody smiles. Don't she? Yeah, well, look, you see, the thing is, mate, people don't realise this, but I just draw what I see. Yeah. It's like, I saw a cow, and then I saw a big, tough bloke, good-looking bloke. So I thought, well, why can't a cow be big and tough-looking? You know, move school. It's like that picture, what I draw of that uh, bloke with, with like four arms and four legs, yeah. People go, always go up to me and go, Leo, that picture of that bloke with all the googly arms and everything, that's fucking amazing that is. I say, oh cheers, yeah, yeah. And they're like, where do you get your ideas? I'm like, oh, it just comes to me, you know. But really, I know that fella. He's my mate, so don't make fun of him. But he's got four arms and four legs, and he always walks around with his knob out. So I just drew that. Right? Apparently he's half spider or something, but I don't know how that happens, you know what I mean? Wait, keep your voice down. At least you'll be up in arms. Well, two.
two arms. Not like that, but okay. Four fucking arms. Anyway, I suppose you're not here to listen to me prattle on about whatever the fuck that was. Oh yeah, you want one of Leo's toys, don't you? Well, if you got the Lira, maybe a little beer, oh, I've got the th Thera theory. Right? Like oh, this chap. He's fucking flying. You ever seen a bloke fly? Nah, didn't think so. You know what this is? Yeah, oh. Price for observation goes to you. He causes a crossbow. But it's on wheels. Hey? Oh, fuck a duck, I never thought of that. I just thought it would be this size for the kiddies to play with, but it could be big, couldn't it? Like you could have a massive one. What would I call it? A ballista, something like that. Really smash people's lads. Yeah, that's a really good idea there. I'll tell you what, I'll credit you. No, I won't. I'll take all the credit for myself. Well, anyway. So you want one of my cutesy pootsy clever schmeller weedy beardy toys do you well I got this for you how would you like to have a screw in the sky you fucking wash your mouth at I don't mean that if you want to join the bloody Mile Eye Club, you climb a big tree, I suppose, and you get a prize. Now I'm talking about like this fella. But this design's shit. It looks like a bat. No one's gonna like enjoy a Batman or anything like that, are they? Doesn't make sense. If you're gonna be anything, you'd be a bird man, wouldn't you? Not a Batman. Sounds like twat man. Oh, I, oh, I, why'd you neck him? I'm just mucking around. You want a fucking toy or for your kid or something? It's for you, innit? No, oh, don't judge. I was just about to make one anyway. Let's have a look here. Oh, watch it. I've got all the bits and bobs. What do you think of that? Oh, look. My, my fucking fingers, yeah. I had a run in with the dog. Yeah. No, I was out running and I bumped into him and he was very upset. He said, what are you doing out here, Leo? Get back inside, you old codger. Right, so what I was gonna make, and I know I don't look like much right now, it looks like a bundle of fucking mess. But I was gonna make this, it's an idea I had. Yeah, I know. Stop me if you've heard this one before, right? Leo and his ideas, fucking hell, what a muppet. Anyway, this one was like this fucking, like a, like a screw, you know? Yeah, and it turns around, but what it does is it uses the air to like lift it up off the ground. See you on there spinning like a twat, and it lifts you up off the ground. Yeah. He'll be able to fucking fly. Well, you won't, he'll be tiny, but I should start like, I'll come up with a lot of ideas, but I only ever make them, they're only little. I should start making them big, you know. But honestly, I feel like I spend half my bloody time taking pictures of Anna Lisa right now, because she won't fucking smile. Anyway, I bet you're thinking, Leonardo da Vinci, more like um, Leonardo the. I wish I she he just shut up. The the. I can't think of anything. Can you? The Mincy. No need to be like that about my sexuality. Next, you'll be having a go at me because I'm a vegetarian. 
Well, you'd have to watch out for moose cops, wouldn't you? Because if cows weren't getting eaten by you lot, they'd all be running around getting fit and beating the shit out of us. All right. Have you got the lira? Could I be any clearer? All right. So you want you want that, then, yeah? Is that all right? Hey, well, you want to watch me make the bloody thing? It'll take ages. Right then, sort it. Are you sure? Alright, then let's get started, eh? Right, so, bloody hell. Looks like a lot, doesn't it? I've got my beard in the bloody adhesives. Well, what are you gonna do, eh? Alright, so, let's see. All this big bit's important. You can tell. Look at all the holes I had to put in it. Anyway, with this one, there should be about seven odd what I call dowels. We'll see why in a minute. Right. It's got these long ones. Yeah. Should be just about 13 centimeters. Oh, well, we don't need to worry about that right now. Let's just get all these dowels and line them up. Move that out of the way. Bloody hell. Flame in the world. Put that there. Oh. Line them all up. In by size, you see. Like that. They're the same length. All those aren't the same length, are they? This is the same length as. Oh, that's not. Oh. Oh, here you go. Hmm. Perfect. Put that there. These two are the same length. Hey. Well, look. Fail to prepare, and you're fucked. That's what I always say. You can quote me on that. Leonardo da Vinci. <laughs> Yeah, you're quite fun, you are. Anyway, I'm bored of that already. Let's take this. Now, we've got to use some adhesive, right? But don't worry about that. So, Gonna have to attach some string at some point. So I need to put these in here like this. Just screw that in like that. Oops. screw what am I like that's all those I have uh, made don't invite Da Vinci he'll only make crude jokes and get drunk too quick but if you get drunk quick just means you have a cheap night don't it mate used to uh, what he used to do he used to donate his humours yeah and as much as he, used to, he was a lad then he used to go out after and he had the cheapest night out he could get drunk on a glass of wine made a fool of himself a lot though but there you go if you fancy a cheap night Give blood. Don't do that. It's a bad joke. What was that? Get out. Oh, well, that's already bloody worn me out. Looking good, right? Next one. 
next up, I've got to take this these bits here. Yeah. That's all they're going to do is fit on here like this. But we've got to glue it on there with adhesive. So I've got some uh, bits I made earlier. Don't judge. Get some glue on there like that. Bloop, bloop, bloop. See, whack it on. Don't be shy. There's loads of it. Plenty of it. Lots of glue. Hey, now if you sniff this stuff, it won't do nothing. Believe me. Put that to one side. Put that on there like that. There you go. Bob's your uncle. And there you go. Daphne's your niece. And there you go. And I'm your father. <laughs> all right, well, we've got all. Right, put that then. You should let the glue dry, really, but we don't have time for any of that. So this is going to be <clears throat> stretched out on here. Yeah. And you'll, it'll feel wrong. But it's oh so right. Put some glue in there. Put some glue in there. Put some glue in there, boy. All right. Yeah, pop a leg in there. Pop a leg in there. Pop a leg in there. Come on. Look at that. Perfect. If I didn't know better, I would say that I was a bit of a Renaissance man. Bit of a polymath, you know. Right now, we've got that done. So let's take this old bloke. What we're doing, we're just putting this in like that. The pressure. So you can only go so far, you see. Don't worry about which direction. What was that? What does that look like? It's a hat. I could see one day things like this being shot off into like the sky or something, you know. But anyway. So we've got the longest here. This one will go to the top, right? I'm doing that right. No, I like that in there. Doing more things. I'd forget my head if it wasn't dramatically affixed to my skull. I don't look right. I'm sure it'll be fine. Not very good. 
mostly we just wanted to not roll around, you know, like that. We don't want it to stick to there because we want it to be able to spin, yeah. And then we got a crankshaft. There's a bit of glue we could do. Make it a gear. Talk to like that. Try not to break it. Leo, I'm proud to you. Now, dude, that's one of the gears, like you see. You'll see how it works in a minute. Don't worry. I'll pop that there. Right, let's just take a look at this. Perfect. 
Now what we'll do is pop that on there. See, but we want it to move. So put a bit of glue on there. Press that down like that. And leave that for a sec, that needs to dry.
this joins up with that. Yeah. And carries on this wonderful pattern. Oops. Way down. Like that, basically. Yeah. Then, here comes the fun bit. We glue everything. What does this do? What do your body think? Makes it fly, don't it? We're gonna leave the pegs on for now. I know. Not very pretty, but believe me. I'll take it home and saw it out later. doing 
button here. It's connecting up with different bits. Like that to there. thinking yeah this better fucking work you and me both mate moment of truth did I have the moose school to make it work That's why they call me the fucking maestro, mate. Invention. 